In this video, I'm going to be breaking down one of the most professional and simple offenses that you can use in Madden 21 that will absolutely help you basically beat every single coverage in this game. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is all about helping people become the best Madden player that they can possibly become. And so if you're looking to get better at this game, I just want to encourage you to click the subscribe button at the bottom of the screen. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel and we post videos every single day that can help you become a better Madden player. Now in this video, we're talking about the U trips or the Y off trips pats. This is a fantastic offensive scheme and we're going to be talking with you in this video about a couple of different concepts that you can use um, to attack uh, different types of coverages we're going to actually work this um, we're actually going to work this route combination specifically against match defense and we're just going to use uh, a very simple little play here pat slot out it's one of my favorite uh, little plays in the entire game the cool part about this formation is this is my favorite two by two set because what really makes this special is um, it, it actually functions more like a spread set um, than you would think because of the motion snapping and some of the matchups that, that can create with the routes that you have. And so I uh, actually have a full ebook on the U trips if you want to get that down in the description below. Uh, I think this is one of the best offenses in Madden 21. I think it's going to continue to be one of the best offenses in Madden 22 because it's been good year in and year out. So we're going to take a look at this play con, uh, play called uh, Y option wheel, if I can find it. Let's see, uh, Y option wheel right here. And then what we're going to do on this is we're actually going to go, uh, I'm going to see if I can go into um, nickel, I think I'm just going to go nickel three, three, or nickel normal. And we're going to sub in some backups here. And we're just going to show this against cover four quarters. Okay. So it's really a relatively simple setup. Uh, what I like about this concept is again there's just so much so many little things little nuances um that you can do with this offense and so uh, the first setup that i like to do is i just like to take the r1 receiver and simply put him on a flat route and i'm just going to motion him across now my first read on this play is always going to be the running back you're going to see that against match coverage this is going to be an absolute laser now typically this is actually going to be a one play touchdown if you get time into pocket um, the running back is one of the most difficult routes for defenses to defend from this formation because of this little motion snap right here you're going to see that this is absolutely incredible as you can see this running back route gets over the top of the match coverage really easily oftentimes it's actually going to be the user defender and they're not even going to realize it and the running back is going to be open for you know several several yards down the field so once you kind of get them to have to respect the running back route um, from this what they're going to do is they're going to man up the running back i pretty much tell you um, verbatim what they're going to do is they're going to man up the running back and so uh, another little way that you can take advantage of this um, uh, advantage of really any defense that people do is by taking the r1 receiver and we're just going to put him on a simple little slant route just like so we're going to take the tight end we're going to put him on an out route and then what we're going to do is we're going to do that same motion now with this concept right here what you're going to notice is that this option route to the running back is going to um, be wide open it's going to be especially if they man him up and, and you know i don't have my defensive controller but if they do man him up that's going to be an easy read as well so now what we're left with is what is this uh, what does the rest of this concept look like against the cover four quarters well the first thing is your tight end out route typically we'll actually do a pretty good job um, if you don't want to put that slant out there another thing that i like to do um, against this is i'll just take r1 and whenever I motion, if I want to use an option route to triangle, okay, what I'll do is I'll actually, um, I'll actually take R1 here and I'm just going to motion him across and I'm just going to put him on a simple curl route. And what you're going to see is I'm going to let him get all the way out here to the numbers and then I'm going to let him set. And what you're going to see is this um, is going to create a nice little spacing concept basically. So the option route or the curl, one of the two are going to be successful. Now the next thing that I like to do though is once we do that, that's going to open up some more space here for the, the opposite side of the field to work against this uh, match defense. And so what you're going to see is this, this tight end route is going to basically allow us to hold zones so that we can throw the post. This post route is special. Um, it is the best route uh, in this play. And if you run this route properly, what's going to happen is you are going to consistently, you can also let him set 
Um, the R1 guy, you can let him set right there and just hit this little quick out, little quick five yard out if they're not playing. And, and if they're not playing hard flats on the outside, that's going to be an easy read. So if they're taking that quarter flat on the outside and they're manning him up on the triangle, then this is another really good reason as to why you can even you can even motion this out right all the way out here. And then now you're really going to get over the top of the defense, as you can see. One of the cool parts about, about cover four quarters or cover four match is motioned out out routes typically do a really good job you just need to make sure that you get them kind of to like right before he sets so if i kind of let him go right there and then snap it you'll see that the glitchiness of the snap and i didn't quite get a good snap right there um because that outside quarter was able to come back down but let me show you let me you don't even have to like get him in motion if you just let him set on this outside, what's going to happen is he's going to pull the quarter flat zone and he's going to pull a uh, quarter uh, outside quarter zone. So you see just like that right there. And then it leaves that little window right there. And again, Brady and, and the pass rush kind of work together to completely, you know, destroy what I was trying to show you. But that's the that's the gist of what's going to happen. Now, obviously, the other thing I want to just really quickly hit on is, again, if you let him set right here and there's no hard flat, you can throw this out route with a lot of confidence. So if they're not playing underneath coverage, you can throw that route, okay? So they're going to give so much attention to this left side of the field that on the, um, on the right side, you're going to open up a lot of space for you to be able to work. A lot of times their user is going to go to the running back, but what you're going to see is, once again, like we were talking about this post route is really really clean and really really effective against this coverage okay so you're going to have really uh, smooth reads now another thing you can do if you want with your tight end is if you want to put your tight end on a, on a just a simple five yard out route um, these again these five yard out routes are really really good so you could put Evans on a five yard out route and streak the tight end if you wanted to right and look at how the zones are going to pull and look at how open that square receiver is going to be over the middle right there. We got a kind of a bad route bounce, but that's kind of the idea of what I'm what I'm really kind of getting at here. Uh, and again, you can just leave this route as is. But this is great. This is a great little play um, against match against zone. The cool part is like depending on where you snap him is going to open up this running back route a ton for you. So this is a really nice little cover four quarters beater, and uh, it's just a really good all around play. If you want to learn the entire U trips offense. I'm going to leave a link to my entire uh, New England Patriots U-Trips offensive guide down in the description. It's one of the best formations in Madden history, in my opinion. It's been one of the best passing sets uh, for the last two to three years, at least. And uh, it continues to be one of the better offenses in the game. So if you want to get the U-Trips guide, it is available down in the description.